Hey guys, welcome back. Today is Monday, June 20th. I'm about to have my breakfast and I will share with you guys what I'm going to have. Um, my food's going to pretty much stay the same for the, over the next like five days. So um, we're going to start with some oatmeal. I got some oatmeal and a protein mug cake here. that and then I have one of these super coffees I was just heating up some of that in the microwave and that will be this for today um, it's almost six o'clock I will be out of work here at 7 30 so I'll catch up with you guys later bye hey guys so I just dropped my son off to daycare I am heading home to go lay down for a little bit and then I'm going to check in with my coach, show her some pictures, and give her a weight update. And probably get some lunch after that, and then do my lift. And then I've got some waxing appointments today in the afternoon. And then I'm going to train a client, and then probably get my cardio in at the end of the day. And that will be my day for today. It's pretty busy, but I think we'll get it all done. I'm feeling really, really good about this peak week. I'm feeling better myself. So I'm ready to tackle this week and just get it done. I just want to have fun, just get it over with. And I will catch up with you guys once I wake up from my guys. So it is now 12.23 on peak week day three. I just woke up from my nap. I did my weigh-in and took my... Um, my photos in my bikini and my heels to send to my coach just waiting to hear back from her and while I wait to hear from her and before I start doing my lunch uh, my Misfits Market box came so let's take a look inside and see what came because I'm going to be doing some food prep either today or tomorrow with this stuff for the rest of the week. So we have some mulberries never had these before but i was like let me give them a try i'm probably not going to try them this week just because i don't want to introduce any new foods but um definitely introduce them into my diet next week after competition and then these oh my gosh i love these um these flatbreads they are delicious I love to cut them up and put them in my air fryer and make them like crackers or like breadsticks. So good. It only takes like five minutes. And then got this. I might take this with me as a little treat after competition. I'm not sure. If not, I'll just leave it at home. No big deal. And then we got some mushrooms. Love me some mushrooms. Easy to digest for me. Green beans. Same. And then got some cucumbers. Got plenty of cucumbers here at home now. So these will be a nice staple for me and they add a lot of volume to your food. So that's a good trick right there. What else we got? Oh, um, I guess a half of a zucchini. And the other half. Not sure what happened there. But we'll try to make the best use out of that. Um, my spaghetti squash. Definitely one of my go-to veggies. Add volume to your food and some more pitas i i love this brand um pitas flatbreads they're all great i same thing with these i put them in my um air fryer and make like crackers and stuff out of them absolutely delicious love doing it highly recommend and then we've got a little bit of kale in here and then all the way down there you see there's some spinach i like to do spinach with my egg scramble so this is all easy stuff. I can easily put this in like a steamer bag and put it in the microwave and just make some quick dinners if I need to or snacks, lunches, and or I could just kind of cut it all up and roast it together. So we'll see what I feel like doing. But these are all like easily digestible vegetables for me. They add volume to my food. So definitely, definitely excited to kind of finish out this week. Um, and then of course we also have here some little cap and crunch treats are for my son along with some other cap and crunch berry treats so yeah 
Crunch Mega Berries. They're also for him. So I got all my veggies. I'm good to go. I should have enough protein for the week. I'm good on my eggs and my chicken for right now. If I need to, I'll run out and get some ground turkey. Um, but everything's looking pretty good. I, I'm really excited and I think we're going to have everything here we need for show day as well. So I'm going to check back in with you guys when I start my workout for the day. Here is lunch. I have an egg scramble with um, tomatoes and spinach with some guacamole on top with some popped cakes like rice cakes. Three of them are serving and I have those. I'm going to kind of make my own little, um, little Mexican feast here of my own. So that is lunch and that's probably what I'm going to keep doing now for the next next few days because it digests well and sits well with me so hey guys so I finished my lunch we are getting um, legs and glutes in right now so now that's peak week um, my exercise is gonna be a little bit different so I'm picking like six to eight exercises that I normally do throughout my normal routines and I'm just gonna do them for like an RPE of seven today. So still a little, still a little high up there. I'm not, not going crazy till I feel like I can only get one or two more out, but just enough to give me a good pump. Um, and I'm, I'm looking to do it. I picked six exercises just because I feel like I've got a lot of time constraints. So I'm not going to try to overdo it this week. So I did six. I'm going to do the hip thrust, RDLs, um, kickbacks, glute pull throughs, split squats and goblet squat. And I'm going to do them all for three rounds, three sets, um, eight to ten reps each one. So hopefully get a good pump with that. And then I am off to my waxing appointment.